So hey there, it's the start of day two for our scuba diving here in Kotal. It is 6 a.m. We have to be in the boat at 6.45. So we got up early. We're walking right now and then we're going to grab something to eat. Then we'll be at the boat at 6.45 and on our way. So this is the main road in Kotal at 6 a.m. You can see it gets a little quiet but start to pick up pretty quick. So here we are, day two. Arriving at the pier, 6.45 a.m. So I did a little bit of research and I found out that the island of Koh Tao, which is where we are, is seven kilometers long, which is about 4.2 miles. And they say it's three kilometers wide, which is about two miles wide. So in case you're wondering how big the island is, it's it's a small island, but once you're here, it's you know it's good size. And then here's that Ko Nang Yon, and this is where we go. So right now we're down here somewhere. The ferry's down here, I don't know exactly where. And we come out and we go up here and we go, we do a dive here. This is where we were yesterday, Japanese gardens. Don't know exactly oh, and then here's where we were in the afternoon and then I don't know where we're going later today there's the Lamfraya ferry over there you can see everybody's lined up to get on it and then the dive boats are full of tanks Hey there, we're at our first dive spot. We're actually in a calm cove with an artificial reef. We're gonna do fish identification. And Kim and Tracy, what is the sign for a parrot fish? What is that? Why is that a sign for a parrot fish? It's a play on a pirate. It's a play on a pirate. So there's something lost in translation, but that's the symbol for a parrot fish. Why don't they just name it a pirate fish? Hey Kim, what's that island behind us? Uh, uh, is it no, it's Shark Island. Kim. Oh, That's oh, where I we... you were no, the one right behind us, that island right there. Take that off video. No, that's <laughs> where that's where we just dove. <laughs> so what do you think of it? Oh, it was good. Um, it was challenging. That was a ch more challenging dive. There was a lot of current at first. We had to do a lot of kicking to fight against that. Disappointed. Yeah. Didn't have my GoPro with me. The colors and the fish and the corals were amazing. Were Big fish, fish too. A lot of fish. So yeah. you're not gonna see it, but I hope you enjoyed our diving video here in Kotal. And uh, we'll be back probably January, yeah. February. <coughs> and what am I eating, Jim? Cookies. What's your favorite thing on this planet? Cookies. Traffic jam.
Hey there, quick update for you. We uh, just completed our second day of diving. We did two dives. We did a fish identification dive and we did a deep water dive. And we didn't get to do the wreck because as you probably saw from some of the other video, it was pretty windy and wavy out there. So it was a little bit too rough to do that. So, but we're done. We are advanced open water certified for scuba diving at Scuba Birds here on Koh Tao. And for the rest of the afternoon, we're on our own. We are probably going to grab something to eat. May or may not share that with you. And then we're gonna hopefully explore some of this island. We may get a scooter, we may walk, we don't know, may take a taxi, but uh, we'll see you in a bit. Hey there, so we ended up renting a scooter. I'll show it to you in a second. And we are riding around the island and we're pretty much down on the south side of the island we just went to the bottom of this hill big hill behind us and there's like a private beach they're charging 50 baht there's no sun out and it's about to rain so we're not going to do that but we'll uh continue showing you what we find and for now i'll show you what our bike looks like and amazingly it went up the hill just fine yeah. <sighs> Exercise. <sighs> I got your old lady walk on film here on video. Excellent. A surprise. We get to go hiking. And Kim doesn't look like she's Not loving it. Me. So they get us. Walk all the way up. Then there's a 50 baht per person. Per person? But it says it has a free soft drink. One yep, one moment. So we caved in. We paid their 100 baht. Funny, 50 baht per person. But they put the sign for 50 baht when you're at the top. They don't charge you at the bottom. Pretty good trick they got there. Yeah. yeah. We go all the way to the top. Oh, check it out. Turn the camera around in a second. I just pulled up the radar, but let me turn the camera around and show you what's coming. I don't know if this video is gonna do it justice, but there is rain right there and it should be here in about three minutes. So the 50 pot was a surprise when we got up there, but you do get a free drink. So that's worth like 25 baht by itself. So it's like you pay 70 cents to get in. And I'll tell you, if you do come here and you end up at the spot, I'd recommend going up there because it was really nice, wasn't it, Kim? Beautiful, like views you won't see anywhere else around here. With the weather being pretty cloudy, I was pretty sure we weren't gonna get a sunset, but let me turn the camera around and show you what we got. Not too bad. And now a couple pictures.